Lesson 234 from A Course in Miracles. Father, today I am your son again. Today we will anticipate the time when dreams of sin and guilt are gone and we have reached the holy peace we never left. Merely a tiny instant has elapsed between eternity and timelessness. So brief the interval, there was no lapse in continuity, nor break in thoughts which are forever unified as one. Nothing has ever happened to disturb the peace of God, the Father and the Son. This we accept as wholly true today. We thank you, Father, that we cannot lose the memory of you and of your love. We recognize our safety and give thanks for all the gifts you have bestowed on us, for all the loving help we have received, for your eternal patience and the word which you have given us that we are saved. And now for the reflection on lesson 234. I love this line. 
where it says, Nothing has ever happened to disturb the peace of God, the Father, and the Son. That's you, the single extension of love and holiness and light that has come forth from the Father into eternity, not into the world, not into a body, because if that were to have happened, if you were to have come into a world or a body truly, then that certainly would have disturbed the peace of God. And yet your mind is unified as one forever. You cannot change this. This is the greatest, the greatest miracle of all. The fact that you cannot change what was created as holy by your creator. You have tried, I have tried, we have done, we've created a world that was based on trying to separate from God, and yet at no time has it ever happened, and this is salvation. And so we honor that, for today I am your son again. I have realized and remembered who I am, and I give only that, for there's nothing but that to give. Any idea that I could give anything but the peace the unification, the love of, and the holiness of divinity itself is the falsity, is the illusion, is the dream. And so today I choose to wake up from that dream. I choose to, re- to realize that it was a dream, and a dream cannot have any true effect. When I awaken and look around and see the heaven which I never left, I realize that I have been whole, protected, safe, and sound always. So today our prayer, Father, today I am your son again. I am your child again. I am the holy extension of your love again. I could not leave. I am here. 